we are again. And I wanted to add this one because I think this one is very important and that is becoming the endless student. Now, out of all the concepts that we'll talk about in this course, I think this is one that a lot of people have trouble with. And I'm gonna tell you why. So a lot of times we grow up in the school system, right? So me, I'm a product of the school system. I actually dropped out of school because I felt like it wasn't getting me where I wanted to go. But here's the thing. We're taught that after we go to school and we get our education, that's it. We should stop learning. That's, we're done, right? And I've actually heard people who say, you know, I've never picked up a book. I haven't, read, I haven't learned anything in years. And these people are shocked when, say, their company goes under or something bad happens where they lose their job and they're struggling to find work in the job market because, well, you decide to stop learning. But as an entrepreneur, I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm giving you a little speech right now, a little rah-rah speech. You do not have the luxury to stop learning. When I first started entrepreneurship, I heard the CEOs read 60 books a year, so guess what I did? I read 60 books a year. And it's because I knew that I always need to keep learning. Look, when I met interesting people and millionaires, I had to take a student role. Even though I was very smart, I was already teaching people and stuff like that, I still looked at these people and said, what can I learn from them? Every person who comes around, I think to myself, what can I learn from them? And that's the same thing you need to understand when it, talk, when it talks about being an entrepreneur. Look, an entrepreneur doesn't stop learning. You need to always be refining your processes, refining your strategies, learning from interesting people, getting interesting talent around you so you can continue to learn. I always recommend reading books, but maybe you don't absorb knowledge like that. So you need to be taking resources just like the one you're in, even if it's a different resource from this, and learning things in order to improve your business. This is so simple and this is so day one, but I've seen so many entrepreneurs just skip over this because they think at a certain point they can read one book and then finally they stop learning. Me, the reason I'm constantly putting out new stuff is because I'm continuing the education. I'm gonna continue your education. I'm gonna give you more advanced ways to do stuff. I'm gonna give you better ways to do stuff. I'm gonna give you stuff that's at the beginning level, stuff that's at the advanced level. I'm gonna give you all this stuff because I understand that no matter what, you need to constantly be learning. So with that being said, I just wanted to break this down a little bit for you. This is a short little video that I wanted to add on here, but this concept is huge. Become an endless student, no matter what. If you're looking at people, study human nature. I look at people around me and try to understand why they think the way they think, understand consumer behavior. I look at friends who are successful and say, why are they successful? What can I observe that's outside just their business skill set, maybe their mindset? And I'll say it again, remember, mindset plus skill set equals success. What mindsets do they have that are helping them be successful? And then, from that standpoint, I don't care how old I get, how much I go in business, I'm always going to be looking for new ways to learn. So, if you want to be truly successful, anybody, anybody who's successful, Warren Buffett, richest man in the world, or at least was the richest man in the world at some point, he reads 700 pages a day. He's reading 700 pages a day. He's a billionaire. One of the richest people to ever walk the face of the earth, and he still feels like he needs to learn every day. So what does that say to you? So with that being said, I want you to become an endless student. I want you to take this very serious and be very deliberate about your learning. Continue your education, so on and so forth. Learn about your business, learn about your craft, learn about different ideas in the world so you can constantly be expanding that mind of yours so you can be a successful entrepreneur. With that being said, that's my time. 